Hey guys, hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Akosia Behene. If you're new, you're welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, hey boo, what it do? So in today's video is a chit chat, get ready with me. Um, I'm, I saw something on Instagram, okay? And it was a little disturbing to me, at least. So I thought that I'd come on here, do my makeup and chat with you guys. So this is something that is going to be chatty. It's a tutorial, but it's a chatty tutorial. So I hope that you guys like it. And without further ado, my loss, let's get right into it. So I saw something on Instagram and to me i'm like oh wow that's this is shaking a lot of tables so i'm gonna just go ahead and read that out to you guys so um it was actually on the shade room so this guy said i can't believe my girlfriend really think that i'm gonna marry her and we'll live happily ever after it's not even done soon as i get soon as i get a decent job i'm gonna leave her and start dating my type the tf the fuck and then it goes on to say <laughs> this is even the crazy part it goes on to say if my girl could leave me for a guy who is well established and appreciates her more than i do i would gladly accept and never hold her hostage just because she's been with me through thick and thin entitlement over people's lives is the reason people resort to violent behaviors people need to understand that we're not entitled to be with them forever just because they're with us when we're broke <laughs> we have each we have our own preferences and that doesn't make me love my current girlfriend any less things change feelings change it's a vicious life cycle i get that is a vicious life cycle i have so many thoughts on this thing i want you guys to comment below what you guys think but first of all the tall and short of this whole thing that the guy is saying right now is basically um he doesn't care if his girlfriend goes through thick and thin with him okay he doesn't care when he gets money and during the time if he feels like he and the girlfriend they don't really like share the same like if he feels like he's not feeling her as much when he's rich he's gonna move on to another girl the same girl that he has been with this whole time while he was broke the same girl that was with him while he was broke and and i mean i i, I think i get his i get what he's saying and everyone has the right to an opinion everyone has the right to a choice in life okay i strongly respect that i'm the type of person that actually strongly respects that people should be allowed to do um, what they want to do as long as it's not hurting someone else. I mean That is definitely arguable, but you get what I'm trying to say I'm saying that he has the right to decide whatever he wants to decide, but I just have thoughts. I just I just have a I, it, See Whatever I'm gonna say In all honesty is just my opinion Okay, you are allowed to have yours in the comment section please definitely i want to hear what you guys think on this but to me i feel like this is i feel like this is offensive on all levels because i i i don't know like it doesn't make sense to me how you go through the mud with someone how you go through thick and thin with someone how you have someone be there for you literally the whole time while you have nobody how you have this woman be there for you when no other woman is looking at you you know what i mean and even outside relationships i feel like people that you go through thick and thin with it's just right that 
I enjoy my better life with you. It's just, it's just right. I feel like it's just right. I don't know how, as a man, as a man especially, this is something that we'll usually hear from women. This is something that in movies we usually see that women are the ones who do it. No, matter of fact, it's men. Wait, what am I saying? Men are actually the ones who get rich and feel like they need another woman. So when the guy said this, when he said this, the comments is what got me. Okay. The comments section. So someone says, you're using her for value. You're using her for the value that she currently adds to your life and she's convenient. As soon as you've leveled up, you feel like you have to leave her because she brings nothing to the table in this your current life she brings nothing to the table but before she was bringing something to the table it doesn't make sense it doesn't make sense to me how someone would just be like that or someone would just choose to do that to someone you know another person is saying this is heavily laced with selfishness exactly what i'm talking about this is just bare selfishness because how come when you didn't have money you didn't see that she didn't bring anything to the table how come when you guys were going through the thick and thin you didn't find the need to sit down and evaluate if this person actually brings something to the table if wait do i actually love this person you never thought about it for one second and then now now that you that's my daughter that you guys hear in the background okay right now she's very loud she is just really really loud <laughs> and then now that you you have like your life figured out right now that everything is okay you think she doesn't bring anything to the table i don't get it <laughs> i really don't get it okay and i side with literally every comment that i'm reading out right now because this is hectic for me any guy that does that i feel like the next woman can't even trust you you know because you left the woman the one woman who was there with you the whole time when you didn't have nothing you left her <laughs> i'm not secured i'm not secured and you know honestly if i am the woman who you leave or like if i am the woman in that situation or if i am not in situation if i am <laughs> if i am the one in that situation I don't think that it will bother me that she left me you know because it just shows the kind of person that you are which means that you are not worthy of me so i will actually thank the universe for doing that because all this while i was stupid and i didn't see that you weren't like you I, you didn't deserve me and it just took us to get money for the universe to show me that it's been a long time coming but i'm grateful I'm grateful that I didn't stay with you till the rest of my life or till the end of my life because then without you, I get to enjoy the rest of my life. Yes, time has been wasted, but I'll still enjoy the rest of my life. You know what I mean? Because it doesn't add up. Nothing adds up here in this comment that the guy made. And nothing adds up. And another person here is saying, leave her now then. I mean, leave her now then. Stand on your own ten toes and leave her alone, which is exactly what I was saying leave her why is it that when you were broke you never figured out that you didn't need her and then now that you're rich oh your smart mind <laughs> your smart mind finally picked up and you do not need her it doesn't make sense so just leave it leave her now like guys i said i want i want you guys to comment <laughs> wow my daughter wow from pa wow like i said i want you guys to comment down below what is um what do you guys think wait let me do this cat crease because who does a cat crease talking nobody so someone another comment here says that this is exactly why girls do girls do the shit i'm sorry i'm really sorry this is exactly why girls do what they do and it is so true because this is exactly why some girls do what they do this is exactly the reason why a lot of the girls turn to do so many crazy shit because they have been through the heartbreak or the heads of a lifetime 
that just alters you know their thinking and everything this happens a lot another person said this is why i disagree with struggle love ladies please stop being bob the builder love yourself enough to hypergamy lifestyle i mean to choose the hypergamy lifestyle and this is also so true because for what is worth it is just really painful or it will be really painful if you go through um, a situation where you've been with someone all through like literally all through times when they had nothing like you both had nothing and the crazy part is you both had a future like you both had a picture in mind you know you knew that one day we are gonna get there one day we're gonna do so so and so and then you guys get there and then finally the guy leaves you and then just goes away won't it be crazy like isn't this crazy because it doesn't even make sense okay it doesn't even make sense and even a man has commented even a man has commented that this is the mindset of this is a mindset or this is the logic of someone who is dusty and this is so true it doesn't even make sense it doesn't i don't know how you can be with a woman all through the times when you know like like nothing was going on for you nothing was happening for you she was literally the only person who would appreciate you and and then you guys finally get to the big day and then you you oh it doesn't make sense to me this is so triggering on all levels <laughs> it doesn't make sense to me it will be so painful for someone to do that to someone growing up see crazy thing growing up i never believed in like struggle love too i never thought that um struggle love was even something that someone should be in but i grew up and then i realized that <laughs> at the end of the day we're all looking for that one person that we find peace of mind with we're all looking for that one person that will give you the respect the love the communication the attention at the end of the day money doesn't even matter okay money it, I, you know money is something that we need for life but money is not something that you need for love take this from me and yes take this from me take this from me someone who in the past or like growing up i would literally say that struggle love was something that no one should go through because men are just too crazy men are just very disrespectful sometimes okay not all men some men are just really disrespectful sometimes and people just do stuff like this people just up and leave yes my daughter is even shouting because it doesn't make sense people just up and leave after you have been through all of the shit with them I'm not even going to take it from the angle of struggle love because people, I mean, right now, who really wants struggle love? Right now, you go for what you're worth. You go for what you deserve. So whatever, I mean, whatever a person chooses, I respect that. I really, really don't care. But I feel like it's really offensive. I feel like if you do that as a man, I mean, as, as a person <laughs> in general, I feel like that is very selfish you cannot do that to another person i mean as the man put yourself in the woman's shoes if she did that to you that's what i always do whenever i'm doing something or whenever i find myself in a situation which involves me and another party i'm always asking myself would i be happy if i got that treatment would i be happy if um i um if she did to me what i'm doing to her you know if it won't make me happy then i'm not gonna do it to you because growing up i've come to realize that what you don't like don't do to someone else what you don't like want to be done to you just don't do it to someone else what you think will hurt you obviously will hurt somebody else may not hurt everybody but there's definitely one person that it will hurt trust me as long as it hurts you it will hurt someone too so um the guy should just you know put himself in the girl's shoes I don't think it's fair on his part you know to to finally 
or to even wait this whole time to get to a stage where um, you feel like okay now I think that I don't I think I'm not vibing with you so I think you should leave I, I don't think I don't think um, it's nice I don't think when you do that is nice okay and another comment here is the fact is money changes people so just stay ready i absolutely agree with um this comment i totally totally agree with what the lady is saying money definitely changes people money will make an enemy out of someone you never thought would be your enemy trust me money will 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 spoil a relationship that you never thought was was ever going to be broken money changes people money is crazy <laughs> it is just crazy i don't know how that's how come money holds so much power to people okay because money has altered so many things um that has just changed their life in their lives in like one way or the other so money definitely changes people money definitely changes people some another person is saying that it, it don't matter because he's not gonna level up no time soon because god knows his heart and his intentions are impure and it's so true too if you have intentions like this you really think you're gonna level up karma is a bitch you're probably gonna level up you're not going to last in your leveling up you will fall back down because the same woman who you had plans and ideas and whatever with, you left her, went for literally a one-dimensional woman, you know, your type of body, your Instagram fave kind of girl, and now you're trying to do life with her. She basically understands nothing about you. I mean, like I said in the beginning, like I said, I totally respect everybody's opinion. I am a strong... Um, um advocate for people should have their own choices and opinions but like i said it's also very very much arguable but also i honestly don't think you have to do that to the woman that you came up with it doesn't make sense so <clears throat> so i know that i said that um i didn't want to talk about struggle love but for some reason i just want to talk about it what do you guys think about struggle love I mean, for my opinion, it will be a little biased because I have been through struggle love. My partner and I, my hap uh, I mean, my husband and I, we literally started from the ground up. <laughs> we literally started from the ground up. So struggle love for me, um, I don't think I, I don't think I have, I can't have so much of a say because then it will make it biased <laughs> because it will be just what i think or it will be based on what i've been through or it will be based on like my love situation but i know that people have so many thoughts about struggle love so take a moment right now comment down below what do you think about struggle love is it something that um but i mean personally I'll say go for who treats you right. Go for who you think is worthy of you, your time, your love, your attention, everything. And um, for me, I got that with my husband. But I know that not so many women will be like lucky to get to get like all of that, get like get the love and everything, and then also still grow together. You know, I know that not so many women are lucky with the loyalty. I know that with a lot of women, um, when the men get to the, the stage where, you know, it's all nice and unicorns and rainbows, they just leave. Um, so I'm grateful. But what do you think about struggle love? What is your opinion? I want to know what you think. It really i don't really care about what i think <laughs> i'd love to know what you guys think so what do you guys think about struggle love is this something that um, i mean what's your take what's your take just tell me okay let me know what you think 
but this look is mainly about the eye look and the conversation and for the most part with what i saw on the shade room i honestly don't have much to say about it again because that's it that's really it for me um i feel like it's not fair it is really not fair to do that to your partner who you've been coming up with who you've been like literally struggling with and trying to build life with i i absolutely feel like you don't have to do that to them so that's just my take okay guys so this is the finished look and yeah that is literally everything that i have to say about um the shade room conversation and also like i said earlier i'd love for you guys to comment down below let me know what is your thoughts on struggle love and also about the conversation that i started the whole tutorial with so yeah also if you like the look comment down below give the video a huge thumbs up i'm gonna go away now thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys in my next one bye Thank you.